$20 chicken sandwich, and I'm like, oh, maybe not. I try not to look at the prices here. What does that drink cost? $22. $48 t-shirt. $98 long sleeve. $174. You don't really expect to have deals at an event like this. New York's signature luxury sports attraction, the U.S. Tennis Open. It's like Disneyland for tennis fans. Get this, generates $472 million over the course of just three weeks. That's a lot of cocktails, clothing, and concessions. I think it's a huge value for the money and uh, the talent you get to see. So where does all that money go? The U.S. Tennis Association wants you to know it's going to growing more future U.S. tennis stars. We're providing equipment to schools. We're supporting our USJ Foundation, which is a network of after-school programs that use tennis as a means to teach broader life skills. That's more than 130,000 kids in 270 programs. And by expanding into inner cities and lowering the cost of entry to the sport, USTA is also growing more diversity in the game. Asian Pacific tennis participation in America is up 37% since 2019. Black participation up 46%. And Hispanic participation numbers up 90%. Part of our mission is to make sure that tennis looks like America. Uh, we're very proud of the fact that if you looked at our participation, 38% of tennis players are people of color. It's a recipe that's not only grown tennis in America, but also the number of stars from America. This year, five U.S. players reached the quarterfinals of the singles draws, and there's a long line of future stars in the pipeline, too. A lot of the people who are doing so well now, especially at this U.S. Open, I'm pretty sure we've all at some point come through USTA. 17-year-old upcoming pro Clearby and Gunaway grew up with USTA programs in the D.C. area. It's unbelievable, those camps, and I'm, I'm so glad that they still have them. Um, they really are such a blessing and a big opportunity. Opportunities that might not be there if it wasn't for all those $20 sandwiches, salads, and cocktails. At the U.S. Open, Noah Pransky, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.